I'm going to try to write 29 37ths as a decimal. So this is the exact same thing as 29, 29 divided by, divided by 37. And this is clearly going to be less than 1. 29 is less than 37. And it's going to involve some decimals here. So let me just put the decimals in place right here so we are ready to use them. So let me throw some zeros, some zeros, as many zeros as we might need. We might need even more than that. But let's see what we can do. So 37 definitely doesn't go into 2. It goes into 2 zero times. 37 goes into 29 zero times. So 20, 37 goes into 290. Well, it'll go into 290. And let's see. I would estimate that it goes, see, 8 times 37 would be 240 plus 56, which is too big. So it's going to be 7. So let's do 7 times. 7 times. And we have our decimal out here. We could throw a 0 out there if we want. 7 times 37. Well, 7 times 7 is 49 plus 7 times 30, which is 210. 210 plus 49 is 259. So it's 259. And we can subtract that. And we are left with 290 minus 259, which is going to be, what's this going to be 10? It's going to be an 8. It's going to be 31. And now we can bring down the next 0. 37 goes into 310. See, that looks like it'll be 8 times. So 8 times. 8 times 7 is 56. 8 times 3 is 24, plus 5 is 29. So 296, it worked out. 310 minus 296, well, that's going to be 14. Now we bring down another 0. Let's bring down a 0 in blue. Bring down another 0. 37 goes into 140. Let's see, does it go four times? That would be 120 plus 28. No, that's too large. It's going to go three times. Three times 7 is 21. Three times 3 is 9 plus 2 is 11. 111. And you subtract, and you are left with 29. This is a fairly tedious problem, but let's see where it goes. So now let's bring down. Bring down another 0. Oh, we got the 290 again. 37 goes into 290. Well, we know this. We've seen this drill before. 37 goes into 290 seven times. Let me do it in that same color as the other 7. It goes 7 times. 7 times 37, we've already figured it out, is 259. You subtract. You're going to get 31. You're going to bring down another 0. And you, you see this whole show over again. 37 goes into 310. We already figured that out. It goes. 8 times. 8 times 37 was 296. 296. You subtract. You get 14. You bring down another 0. So you bring down, so we already brought this 0 down. We're going to bring down another 0. So let me make it clear which zeros I'm bringing down. So this is this one right over here. And we're about to bring down another, or we just brought down another 0. So that's this zero right over here. 37 goes into 140. We've already done it three times. Three times. And so we see this pattern repeating. It's 0 0.783, 783. And it's going to keep going 783, 783, 783, on and on and on forever. So we can write this as, we can say this is the same thing as 0 0.7. I'll do the same colors. 783. And to show that we keep repeating not just the 3, we keep repeating the 7, 8, 3, we put this line over all 3 right over here. So this literally means that we repeat 7, 8, 3, 7, 8, 3, 7, 8, 3 over and over and over and over again.